Welcome back, Classic Gamers, and thanks for viewing Jay the Classic Gamers. Let's play Dungeons & Dragons Order the Griffin for the TurboGrafx-16 Part 20. When we last left off, we finished exploring King Halav's tomb, cured the Duke's poison, and we received King Halav's staff. So with that said, let's get started. There was a few things I went ahead and did in between episodes. I went to the magic shop and went ahead and got the Mage, the Ice Storm spell, and the Dimension Door spell. I also sold all the items I didn't need, and I bought us five more wands of fireballs. Oh yeah! So let's go to the last dungeon, Korzegi's Keep. Ugh, giant crabs and a wyvern. I have no time for you. I am fleeing. How in the hell did I not get away? You know how slow giant crabs and wyverns are? Just look at them. Look how slow they move. You gotta be able to outrun that. Yay, finally got away. Now what is it? Oh shit, it's two Spectres. I don't want to mess around with these guys. Let's go ahead and try to turn them. Awesome, it worked on one of them. Turned them both. Excellent. You are standing near Korzegi's keep. Will you enter? Yes, we will. A voice shouts. Intruders, kill them! And right off the bat, we are being attacked by some clerics and some undead. Let's start kicking some ass. Let's get rid of some of these assholes and start turning them. Now let's blow him up with a fireball. Damn it, my wand of fireballs ran out of charges. Oh shit, my fighter just got held. That's not good. I don't even know what the hell he just cast on me. I don't use that spell, but let's start turning some more undead. Let's go ahead and equip another Wanda Fireball and start blowing these assholes up. That's some bullshit. After one use, my wand's already used up. Well, I guess we'll have to equip another Wanda Fireball and start blowing them up again. There are some weak plus one magical items here, but I can't leave this dungeon, so I'm not even going to bother picking them up. Look, the Rat Lab spies have come to join our party. I haven't come here to join your party, but I will get this party started with a fireball. Let's go ahead and use a hold person on the more powerful mage. I'm not worried about the weaker mage. <laughs> I 
Now let's start blowing them up with a fireball. Oh, to hell with it. Why not? Let's use another fireball. You gotta be kidding me. Another one of fireballs ran out of charges. Well, we do have plenty of them. Let's go ahead and equip another wand of fireballs. Once again, there's another plus one mace, but I'm not going to worry about it. There is a red dragon here. The door closes behind you and the dragon attacks. Bring it on, red dragon. It's probably not a good idea to use a fireball against a red dragon, so let's use Ice Storm instead. Magic Missile! Uh oh, this is gonna hurt. Magic Missile! Ouch! Not only did it hit the thief once, it bounced off the wall and hit him again. This is way too early in this dungeon for someone to die, so I'm gonna have to edit this part out and I'll see you in a minute. Alright, we're back. Let's try this again. There is a red dragon. The door closes behind you and the dragon attacks. Alright, hopefully this battle goes off a lot better than that last battle. Yeah, let's do it again. Let's use Ice Storm against the Red Dragon. Yeah, I know I said it probably wasn't a good idea to use Fireball against a Red Dragon, but I need to kill this bastard. And what do you get for killing a red dragon? Some scrolls, some boots of speed, and a magical sword. I don't even know why I picked up these items. The only thing I wanted was the boots of speed. Now let's go ahead and equip the boots of speed on our fighter. This will give him maximum movement no matter what kind of armor he is wearing. Uh, interrupted by some werewolves and a wyvern that got their asses kicked. And I used up another Wanda Fireball, so let's go ahead and equip another one. There are white dragons here. The door closes behind you and the dragons attack. 
Oh no, he's using his breath weapon. I really hope that didn't work. Oh shit, he's attacking my cleric. Are you kidding me? Now I'm gonna have to redo this dungeon all over again. So I will be editing this out and I'll see you in a few. Alright, after fighting those first three battles all over again, we are back here at the White Dragons. There are white dragons here. The door closes behind you and the dragons attack. Alright, white dragons, let's do this again, but this time you're gonna get your asses kicked. Haha, -ha, your charm person didn't work this time. Now let's see how much white dragons like a fireball. I'm not messing around with these dragons. They're getting another fireball. I really don't give a shit if that worked. As long as you don't charm my mage or my fighter, I'm okay with it. And look at that, the charm person spell didn't even work. Magic missile. And what do you get for killing three white dragons? A bunch of shit I don't even need. The interruption rate down in this dungeon is ridiculous. Just look at this shit. I get interrupted four times before I get my party completely rested. This gets very annoying and is a major pain in the ass. There, I'm finally fully rested. Ooh, what's in here? A cleric, some undead, a rat, and a purple carrying crawler. Let's start kicking their asses. First things first, let's start turning some undead. That was awesome. I got rid of the level drainers. Now let's blow these assholes up with the fireball. Magic Missile! Let's go ahead and get this fight over with by webbing his ass. Here we go again with the interruption bullshit. You hear a conversation in the next room. You owe us 15,000 gold, not 5,000. We want our money. The Iron Ring lost the stones, and now the vampire has to change the prisoners to undead himself. You are lucky he pays you anything at all. He should kill you. It is not our fault that the vampire did not anticipate the adventurers causing so much trouble. He should kill them, not us. The vampire has everything arranged. They will bother you no farther. Take your money and leave. The Iron Ring members pick up the money. As they turn to leave, they see you. Won't bother us any farther, eh? Luck. 
I don't believe it! Attack! Oh shit, we're being attacked by some fighters, some clerics, and a thief. Bring it on. I was going to use Ice Storm here, but didn't realize it had such a short range on it. So I went back to the good old trusty Fireball. Oh no, please don't hold my thief, you dumbass. Let's see how you like a hold person, asshole. Haha, <laughs> payback's a bitch, isn't it? Magic Missile! Awesome! My mage gained a level. Now all my characters are maxed out at level 8. Now let's go ahead and memorize some new spells with the mage. I can get me another web and another ice storm. I'll take them. The bad thing about learning new spells is that you gotta rest. And of course, we're interrupted by some undead. And look at this, they put the undead right next to my mage. So guess what? Yep, the white just level drained him. Now he's back to level 7. This dungeon is so hard. There are just so many monsters that can kill you and so many monsters that level drain you. It's ridiculous. About time it's my mage's turn. Let's get them the hell out of there and let's fireball their asses. That definitely was not worth it. I should have never rested in the first place. Imagine that. Interrupted again. This dungeon was so hard, it probably took me about 10 times and about 5 to 6 hours to finally beat it. There is a black coffin in the middle of the room. Do you want to open the coffin? Hell yeah! Ah uh, ah uh, ah uh, ah, uh, thank you for joining the Vampires Undead Army! What the hell are you talking about? I'm not here to join the army, I'm here to kick the army's ass. And while I'm at it, I'm gonna kick your ass too. I seriously doubt this will work, but let's try to use a hold person on him. Yeah, that's what I thought. I know one thing that will work on him. A fireball. And my sword works on him pretty good too. Do you want to destroy the coffin? Hell yeah, let's blow that son of a bitch up. Oh shit, what's in here? Some undead, some doles? Oh no, it's a devil swine! The devil swine must die. Yeah, let's definitely blow him up with a fireball. There is a black coffin in the middle of the room. Do you want to open the coffin? Hell yeah. 
And I got a couple rings of fire resistance that I do not need. Interrupted by a couple spectres that I ran from. This weak ass group really wants some? Come get you some. Oh yeah, you know what time it is. It's fireball time. If you got them, you might as well use them. Magic Missile! Fighters, mage, and a thief. Oh my. Let's go ahead and use hold person on the mage. Awesome, it worked. Who are you trying to roll up on, thief? You're about to get busted up. Let's mix it up a little bit and use an ice storm this time. Interrupted by annoying gargoyles. There is a black coffin in the middle of the room. Do you want to open the coffin? Hell yeah. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh, thank you for awakening me from my sleep. Now you shall experience life from death. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Yeah, 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 whatever you say, vampire. I don't care if it's just one enemy, he's still getting fireballed. Magic Missile. Do you want to destroy the coffin? Hell <laughs> yeah, we do. Let's tear that son of a bitch down. Several monsters are fighting here. Bugbears lie frozen on the ground, paralyzed by the foul's touch. Goblins hide in the corner, trying to avoid the fight. You see one bugbear lift up a thou high in the air and throw it across the room. The thou lands inches from your feet. The thou gets up, shakes its ugly head, looks at you and shouts, Look, food! The bugbears and the thou stop fighting, look at you and attack. Alright, bugbears, thous, and goblins, come get you some.
The only monster I'm really worried about is that wyvern, so let's go ahead and use an ice storm on him. Let's go ahead and blow up these thousand goblins with a fireball. This game would really suck without the fireball spell. So what I'm going to do now is end this video. We will continue exploring Korzegi's Keep in the next episode. So this concludes Jay the Classic Gamers. Let's play Dungeons and Dragons Order of the Griffin for the TurboGrafx-16 Part 20. I want to thank you again for watching and be sure to stay tuned for Part 21.